All right, Facebook, YouTube, good morning, guys. This is Courtney Scobie, and we also got a ride along for the Carolinas, Robert. We're gonna be doing a screening and recoding today. This is a new client, Michelle. Uh, she's moving into this home. I came out here probably a month ago while the home was still occupied with the last homeowner. And what we're gonna be doing today, guys, is a uh, kind of a light screening, um, or light sandy screen and recoding, show you guys what we're doing. Uh, we're gonna be doing this hallway right here. I don't, I don't think we're doing this room. Uh, not those room. This hallway, this right here, this kitchen area. This area right here, you see a lot of rotten wood right here. All through here, through here, the stairs. And all through here. Uh, nah, we're fine. And uh, we're going to get started, guys. Um, the first of two jobs today. Our next job is just a simple uh, clean and buff. Stay tuned. All right, guys. We are trying to get this air, those areas that had all that rotten wood. Uh, trying to smooth that out. Actually, had to do some sanding. So we had to sand this down. Then we want to try to blend it in. Again, this is not a sanding job, but this is something we just like to do to try to uh, also remember back here, see how all that wood was rotting out. So just uh, sand it, smoothing that down. Now we're doing the screening process. Put your hand wide. Also, we got our rod alone, first time using a uh, 175, but he's, he's, he's got it already. Most guys don't, remember the one guy that came with us with the condo, Raphael? But well, he could not get it to save his life. Here we go. Also, too, guys, I'm starting to uh, hit that foyer down there, knock all that rotten wood off. So, uh, all right, guys, stay tuned. All right, guys, we are putting the first coat down. As you can see right there, that's a big difference. After screening, uh, cleaning, and prepping these floors. Floors are looking so much better. Uh, we got Robert doing some rolling. Also, those areas back there, um, we sanded that down as much as much as possible to try to help blend it back in. But eventually, you know, these floors have never been serviced. But eventually, these floors will probably need a full sanding. But right now, we just wanted to make them look as good as possible so the client can move in. And overall, guys, they are looking really, really good. You can also see that foyer area right there. I fully sanded this area right here. Got all that old rotten wood off. So then this is ready to uh, to uh, coat as well. Don't worry about your footprint. You can get them out. And Robert is rolling. All right, guys. We have minimum light, and today is not a sunny day. Um, so. But again, you can definitely see a big improvement on these floors. All right, guys, stay tuned. They blending in pretty, you know, you can still tell, but you can see it look a whole lot better. Yeah. All right, guys, just got back from lunch. Uh, the first coat is already dry. We're about to start getting ready to apply the second coat. Just wanted to show you guys some things. Uh, so remember back here, we had all that rotten wood. We sanded that down as much as possible. Tried to blend it back in. Now eventually, because this floor is a pre-finished floor, so it has aluminum oxide on it. So we still took the um, the, the, the proper uh, procedures to screen the aluminum oxide so the poly can stick and hold to it. But this area back here, we had to do some sanding, okay? Because it was just so much rotten wood and just wanted to kind of help it blend in. Also stain this area. But eventually, you know, if the customer wants to do it, you know, you never know. Um, eventually this floor would need to be fully, fully sanded for all of this to blend in. Because right here, this floor still has the pre-finish on it, but that right there is all going. It's, it's just worn off. And again, we just sanding it down to help it blend in as much as possible. Also, this foyer came out really good. Okay, see that right there? They came out really good, the stairs. So we're gonna go ahead and start getting ready to prep for the second coat. And then my client should be back around 4.30. And, uh, but yeah, man, overall, the floors are coming out really, really well. She went with a semi-gloss finish. And that second coat is always gonna make it look even better. So, uh, yeah. All right. 
That's really, really good. Really good. All right, guys. Stay tuned. Uh, 770-896-8876. Yeah, I come by Wednesday. Yeah, uh, after I do that, before after I do that, drive me comments. Come and give you an estimate on the other house. Okay, cool. All right. See? All right, guys. Well, just uh, my client just got back, and uh, we're done, and they're very, very satisfied with the services. So again, we sanded uh, this area down, uh, put some stain on it. So much better. And also this foyer area, guys. Remember this foyer came out so much better, so much better. And the stairs, in the hallway. So they're actually gonna have me come by the other house Wednesday um, and give them an estimate on the other house in the master bedroom. All right, guys, another satisfied client. Um, that's gonna do it. I actually sent Scoby and Robert to the next job, which is just a clean and buff of uh, engineered floors. And then we'll be back at it tomorrow um, to do a screen of Rico, almost 2,000 square feet. See you in the next one.